All right, guys, in today's video, we're going to talk about some more fake images from, from Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Now, the first one is <laughs> clearly fake, but I have been, it's been sent to me. These images have been sent to me so, so many times, you guys wouldn't believe it. So the first one is of what appears to be camera, and it's I think it's camera. I've got really bad quality images right here in front of me, but I think, it, yeah, it's on camera like four, I think. And it's an image of like a cave on the left side, and then on the right there's some stairs, and it's supposedly from Final Fantasy Phase Three. Now, I hate to burst your bubble, guys, but it's the first time I, <laughs> right when I saw this image, I knew exactly what it was from. It's from Super Mario 64. Um, it's a part in the game, like right before you um, go to like King Boo's castle or something like that. And uh, just as soon as I saw the image, I was like, okay, this is clearly just that part of the stage. Just somebody added in like the camera screen in front of it. So. That one debunked. There you go. It's from Super Mario 64. I don't know who they were, <laughs> who they were trying to trick on that one. But like I said, some of these aren't actually just people trying to, you know, pretend and make, make the news or something like that, saying that Final Fantasy 3 is real. Some of these are just fan-made screenshots or fan-made art that people decided to do for the game. Now the next one beneath that one is of apparently Pirate Cove. It's got the red curtain and then a sign that I can't read what it says because like I said before, really bad quality images I have set like right in front of me. But um, it's just basically a Pirate Cove. It, it looks realistic, I have to say, but that one is also fake, but it is really cool. So the other ones are some of the ones I've already went over, like the one of Bonnie. It has like a more serious face on him. And his face is actually back on his body, so that's how you kind of know. I mean, something's up here. So that's also fake. And then so is the BB one, where he's holding a hammer, and he's got the wires sticking out of his eyes. He's missing an eyeball. He's got wires sticking out of his left arm, or his right arm, and he just looks all beaten up. That's fake. And then there's one of the marionette that has a burnt face. These are really cool, actually, but they're just fake. His, he's missing his right eye also, and he's just tore up into pieces. Now, the one beneath that is really interesting, actually. I actually really like these. Um, I don't think these were made to try to trick people. I think these are just, like, simply, like I said before, fan art or just something that somebody wanted to make. So the first one is of this animatronic person. He looks really creepy and really cool. Um, he's got red cheeks, just glasses. You can see on screen right now. Hopefully, I'll find more high-resolution pictures. If I don't, check the description, and I'll just post it on there once I find them. But, uh, I mean, these are just some really good drawings. And uh, the one beside him is of, of this really cool... I'd really like to see this become an animatronic, actually. It's of this, like, cat-like creature. It looks like it looks like a, just a kitten, kind of. But it's got, like, fangs and then pink cheeks. It's got the glossy finish. It's got just so many different, you know, uh, different um, forms of it, basically. If that makes sense. Uh, like one where it's staring into the camera with its mouth open another one where it's like attacking you Another one where it's just showing half its face like we've seen in the trailer and it's just it's really cool um, Especially the one where it's looking into the camera and its eyes are pure white like it's missing the eyeballs it Just has like the white thing that we've all seen before in the other animatronics. They're really well done and um, props to whoever made these but these are fake, remember that. All right, so the last one is the one I've received the most out of all of these and it is of Five Nights at Freddy's 3, Welcome to Freddy Land. And basically, they're trying to say that basically the next one is going to be in an amusement park. Now, why that would, while that would be really cool, um, I don't think it really fit the story. I mean, I guess it could, but it's just, it's fake because the font isn't that good. The picture you can probably find somewhere else online. And Welcome to Freddy Land, I mean, that sounds, I guess that kind of makes sense because the first one's called Five Nights at Freddy's, so... You know, maybe they went from being a diner to opening an amusement park somehow. <laughs> but that's about it for this video. Really, guys, I just want to go over that all of these images that you're going that you're seeing online are fake, even if they look really good, like the ones like I said before with the um the cat and the man. Those do look really good, actually. They look better. <laughs> they look kind of better than the ones that are there in Five Nights at Freddy's Two and Five Nights at Freddy's One. But they are fake, guys. All right. So if you guys don't know, if you're wanting to find official information from Scott check the steam page uh, of finance phrase 2 he updates that periodically he doesn't really do it anymore since the game was released but that's where we find information or from scottgames.com or the official youtube channel so if you see it from like a twitter account or a i don't know facebook account he does not have a twitter he does not have a facebook as of right now at least maybe he will later on but for right now he does not have either of these things um, if you want to get in contact with him, check his website. He's got an email. You guys can send him whatever you guys want to ask him 
Um, it's right on the bottom part of the email. But anyways, that's it for today's video. Just watch out for these images. While they do look really realistic and they do look really good, um, they are fake. So thank you guys for watching. Let's see if we reach 1,000 likes. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Thanks for watching. Peace.